Hi guys. <laughs> I'm Michelle and I'm a Scorpio. I'm Ashley and I'm a Gemini. And together we're Scorpio Gem. Scorpio Gem. We're clever, aren't we? <laughs> so, um, we just want to give you, um, like, just kind of an idea of what our channel is going to be about, what we're going to be um, filming, what we're going to be talking about, uh, just things like that. Yeah, um, and we hope to just have fun with this channel and have fun with you guys and, um, I don't know, be a, be just a, a hangout spot or whatever for people that are fucking bored and have nothing else better to do with their lives and want to watch two complete strangers talk just about talk about makeup life and, and life. Yep. Um, we hope to vlog. Um, we do interesting things every now and then and maybe we will vlog those and post them. We hope to go live on um, Facebook pretty often. Thank you guys so much for all the likes that you've given us and we haven't posted a damn thing for you to like except a really shitty JPEG as a cover photo yeah, <laughs> of our logo. Um, we actually have already filmed this video once. Uh, we filmed it on my GoPro and it, I don't know what happened, but it corrupted. Yep. So we are re-filming all this all over again. But um, it's going to even be better this time, so I'm not even mad. Yeah. So. People only want to talk to me when I'm filming. Um. <laughs> So yeah, uh, today we went on a shopping trip. We didn't vlog any of it or anything because we went to the Huntington Mall. And it was worse than Black Friday. Everybody had their crotch goblins out. Yep. It was so bad. Yep. How long did we wait in line at Bath and Body? We waited in Bath and Body out. at least half an hour, I would say. The line, there was a sale at Bath and Body today, if you guys didn't know. Everything for like body related was like $5. So, um... There was like a line that was past two stores along the wall that their entrance is like, yeah, there was a lot of fucking people. It was way it too was, much, but it was way worse than Black Friday. If you went to the Huntington Mall on Black Friday, today was worse than that. I was at the mall on Black Friday and like today was way worse. I don't know if everybody just waited to the last minute to do their Christmas shopping. I don't know what the deal is, but... Y'all can miss me with that shit. I will order everything to my door until the day I die. Like, I love the spirit of Christmas and the spirit of the holidays. And I love how everyone is just giving and joyous and everything like that. But at the same time, it's just greedy capitalism. And it just ain't my thing to stand in line for ever for something but with that being said <laughs> we did stand in line we stood in line, line and it was for me and i have a hell of a haul that i'll show you guys here shortly but um it was really awesome and i'm stocked for a good six months at least i would say yeah so we um, also um i have an ipsy um this is the ipsy plus box that we're going to unbox i've already unboxed it because a thing in it was one of her Christmas presents. Mm -hmm. I also have the um, Jeffree Star mystery box, which is already unboxed because one of them had her Christmas present in it. <laughs> so um, we're going to do that and we're going to do um, her bath and body haul. So do you want to start? Sure. Start with the bath and body? Sure. Okay. So this bag weighs a bunch. I had the lady uh, double bag it because I, I just know that it couldn't contain everything that I had in it, but I'll show you really quickly what I got and I'll show you like how much I paid for it. Um, I got a $10 off 30 deal because this bitch gets coupons at the wazoo. So we probably will do some videos on that as well. I do coupons yes. literally for everything that I own. I've couponed for. So, um, we'll do some videos about that. Also a little side note. If you hear a bunch of jingling and ruckus in the background, I brought my dog to her house. She has cats and, um, so She's just getting, having a good old time. Yeah, they're getting to know each other. They're so partying. You may hear a little ruckus going on in the in the background. So the first thing that I like made sure that I was going to get was this gingham. Um, this is the body wash. I actually got two gingham body washes and a lotion. It's because it's my favorite scent, but um, I don't know if you guys know anything about this scent but it's just really fresh and mm, that was originally 
It was originally twelve fifty. And she got it for four ninety five. Four ninety five. It just smells so clean and floral and just I don't know. It, it just smell smells happy. Clean. Just it, smells happy. To me, it kind of reminds me a little bit of cucumber melon, but not exactly yeah. like cucumber melon. Yeah. But it's um not so cucumbery or melony. Right. It's like a hint <laughs> of cucumber melon. Yeah. This one is a mutual favorite of ours, which this is frosted is coconut snowball. And um, it smells like a fucking frosted coconut snowball. <laughs> it smells delicious. It smells like, I don't know, if yeah. if your beach trip happened in the middle of Christmas. <laughs> well, um, when I went to Daytona, I went to Daytona in September. That is what I took with This is me. what you took? Yeah. yeah. That's what I used. Um, Originally twelve fifty also. At the beach. Um... Let's see. I got this pink velvet cupcake. I had never smelled this before. I've never smelled that one before. And you before. hadn't either. Mm -hmm. And I think it was when we were standing in line. <laughs> yeah, we were, we were just sniffing line. everything that we were standing there. And I swapped out so many things <laughs> to get. I had like, I had a few sets of things that were like the lotion and the soap and the spray. And I ended up putting all the lotions and the sprays back just so I could get more body wash. Because a bitch living on that. a budget. I never do that. When I, when I go to Bath and Body, I, uh, no. It smells I so damn good. I break the bank every single time. Except for today. I did not today. No, she didn't. The only thing she got was, um, a hand sanitizer holder. A hand sanitizer holder and, um, your vanilla bean. A little body wash. A travel vanilla bean Christmas vanilla bean. Whatever the fuck. Yep. Um... This smells amazing. This is black cherry Merlot, and I love everything cherry, everything raspberry, everything strawberry, blueberry, blackberry. Bury me the fuck up, but because it smells so good to me. This smells like um, it smells more like cherry candy to me. It has like uh, it says that it's like Merlot. Cherry Kool -Aid. Like cherry Kool Aid. Yeah. Like um, Merlot is supposed to smell like the wine Merlot, and it's supposed to be like I guess dry or something. I don't know, but this is really good, um, and I love the bottle because it's so shiny and so pretty. Um, here recently, I have been having to shower at Michelle's house, um, and she lives right down the road from me. We're like literally five minutes from each other. And I made the comment because she literally has like a Bath and Body store in her house. I don't even know why I had to go to the store. I should have just went to her house and gave her twenty two fucking dollars in a coupon, and I could have got what I wanted. I could need a coupon. <laughs> yeah, <so>. <laughs> just get hand it back to you. Be like, no, you can keep this, but yeah, let me cash it in. But um, since I've been showering at her house, um. She was at the end of a cucumber melon body wash um, bottle whenever I was there. And I use her shit because I'm too lazy to bring my own. And um, as I got in the next day and I was like, I've never in my life taken a shower where I've gotten out smelling like fucking cinnamon pumpkin. <laughs> because um, I just have like a little a Rubbermaid drawer full of them. And so when I run out of one in the shower, I just open the drawer blindly, reach just in grab and grab it. it. And it happened to be pumpkin. I do not like the smell of pumpkin. I don't like anything pumpkin flavored. I don't like anything that smells Which like pumpkin. Which is strange for her to have in her shower. But I mean, that's but, just But I mean, great. I just opened the drawer and it happened to be cinnamon pumpkin cupcake or some, 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 I I don't know, something. Something about pumpkin. To see if I still smelled like it and I don't. Um, raspberry sugar. This is so good. This is probably the first one that I'm going to uh, crack open. Do you want to bring it? Whenever I can take showers at my house again. Anybody know anyone that works on well water filters, water well pumps? Give me a holler. Your girl needs some assistance. Uh, got the gingham lotion, naturally. First off, um, also we should um, disclose, we are not sponsored. If the camera goes tumbling, the cat just jumped up to check out the, <gasps> the, the ring light. Get down, um, We are not sponsored. We are not being paid by any of the companies that you're going to see, any of the brands that you're going to see. Everything is bought and paid for with our own money out of our own pockets. We yes. get no PR packages. We're not sponsored. We're not paid. This nope. is just the things that we like. So. But if you guys want to do that, holler at us. We'll take your money. Get down. Go on, oh, Not too bad. She just shook it a little bit. Yeah. Also, I had another coupon that Michelle gave me, and I got a free little baby cucumber melon. Um, hand sanitizer. Hand sanitizer. And I think that's it with what I got. 
across the coconut, gingham, 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 and these other four. Yep. So that's all that I have for this. Okay. But it was a damn good haul. She got all that for like $22. $22, by the way. Yes, $22. Eight items. Okay. So I'm going to go into the Ipsy box. If you're not familiar with Ipsy, it's a monthly subscription um, box. They have a $12 one where you get, I think it's five sample size small products. They have the $25 box where you get five deluxe size products. And then they have a $50 box where you get, um, I don't remember how many products, but it's a mixture of full size and sample size. I just get the $25 box because, I mean, it's a great deal. So let's get into that. Oh, and if you want to subscribe to Ipsy, um, I have a link. I'll leave it in the description box down below so you can check that out. Um, also on Ipsy, um, at the beginning of every month, you get to choose one item that you receive in your box. So the item I chose was the Tarte Stay Spray Setting Spray. And I haven't used it yet. I uh, haven't tried it. I haven't, um, I haven't even opened it to smell it or anything like that. I'll play with this foamy stuff. Foamy stuff. So here's what the bottle looks like. It's just in a spray bottle. Who am I? Build the wall. <laughs> Build the wall. And the setting spray retails for $25. Okay, so wait a second. It comes you can't with a... see the card because... Oh, it has a thing on it. Yeah. Well, so it comes with a card, though, that tells you... Yeah, it comes with a card that tells you um, everything that you got in your box and the retail value of it. So I paid $25 for this whole box, and this, this spray just got me my money back. Yeah. And that's a full size, isn't it? Yes. The next thing I've got is a contour press and set and bronzer brush. It's Ooh. Um, by Complex Culture is the name brand of it. Let me see this. The writing's gold and my ring light's not wanting to pick it up, but it's the... We designed this brush to make your life easier. Have you, and you haven't opened this yet? Yeah, I remember I video called you and showed you. <laughs> I don't it's a really nice, thick, heavy brush. Ooh. The bristles are super, super oh, soft. Oh, yes, yes, yes. I remember you doing that. Yeah. And the brush retails for $35. So we got the $25 Tarte setting spray and the Look at this brush. $35 brush. So I already Ooh. got my, my money back just off of the two products that we just pulled out. Yep. Isn't that really nice? Like it's This is heavy super and, like, nice. This is like, I love this. And I never would have bought that for myself. You know, just, I would never pay $35 for a makeup brush. Whatever. Maybe, maybe a kit. <laughs> mm, nope. nope I don't know. My, my brushes, my makeup brushes were 50 bucks, but they came in a leather, um, leather case and things. I've had it for like three years. Um, this is just a um, super oil face oil. A super oil face oil. That's what it says. Okay. It's not gonna, um, the ring light is not wanting to focus me, but it just says apply two to three drops a.m. or p.m. as needed. And this little face oil retails for $68. Jesus. It says instant right. moisture instant moisture without heaviness. This plant-based oil goes it on goes, like a yeah. serum. It soaks in instantly and doesn't leave behind any greasy residue. Yes. Apply two to three drops for skin that's radiant, supple, and super glowy. And it retails for $68. It's still no longer. $68 freaking dollars. I'd never pay $68 for a face serum either because... I mean, I'm 30 years old, but I don't think I need serums all that much right now. Uh, now's the time to start using them, sister. Um, anyway, moving on. I got this, um, Magnetic Build Your Own Palette. No shit. 
You can pick whatever shades you want. Did you show me this too? Yes, I did. Oh, I don't remember anything. You think I she's seen all this before? But okay, yes, dude. I thought I dreamed that. It came with four shades. I thought I came up with that on my own in a dream already. But if you, hey, hey. guys, sorry. Cat fight, cat dog fight. But if you want okay. to add um, your own shades, you can just take the little divider out, and then it's an empty pan to add as many shades as you want. It did come with a mirror, and this retails for sixty dollars. It's cute and everything, but uh, those colors are not the best. Well, now I can't get it back either. Whatever. And the last thing that I have to show you, I can't tell you the retail value of it because um, on the second of every month, Ipsy lets you choose add-ons that you can add on to your box. I only paid $12 for this. It's the Morphe Lo-Fi Sculpt and Shimmer Palette. Um, I, I don't know what the retail value of it is. I only paid $12 for it, but... Babe, will you take Rue somewhere and just get rid of him? Here's that. So you have your highlighting colors here. Babe. Your, um, your bronzer and your contouring shades are these four shades here. So you got four highlighting shades and four contour bronzing shades. Somebody just jumped in my seat. Drinks. Go on. <laughs> she was looking for a cat food, I bet. We're sitting where our cat food goes. <laughs> and... And that one. Every Ipsy this, box that, that you get box. comes with a bag. So we got this beautiful silver shiny bag. It's cute. The inside is kind of blue. It looks black on camera, but it's blue. Has a cute little zipper with the Ipsy on it. And it's that. blue. I can see that. So yeah. That's it for the Ipsy box because like I said, one of the items that did come in my box are going to be in her Christmas bag thing for me. So that's that. Hey, Des. Yeah. Gypsy's outside screaming like an idiot. Can you run her off? She is. It sounds like she's right here. Yeah, she is. She's right here, literally. Sorry about that, guys. If you're animal owners, you understand. Yeah. Okay, so the next thing we're going to be opening is the Jeffree Star... Mystery Big ass box. box. I like how cute this box is. It has the Jeffree Star logo, the mystery question mark, and stockings. Yeah, there's a stocking. Oh, disclaimer yeah. also, um, we just became aware of what Morphe did to their uh, staff and their workers. So we have agreed to we're not gonna we're not gonna purchase, purchase shit from them anymore either. Um, if it comes in an empty box, so be it. We'll use it, but as far as seeking them out. Fuck you, Morphe. We ain't doing right. it. And I have purchased this sculpting palette before any of the drama went down with Morphe. Um, had I known prior to that, I wouldn't have purchased it. Yeah. But I'd already purchased it before things went to hell. Yeah. Anyways, on to the Jeffree Star Mystery Box. So, when you open it, you see all this <laughs> craziness. This, which is just wrapping paper. And then you see this. Look at this. This is a, what is it? A, a jacket? A hoodie? A hoodie. I'm going to open it so you can see it. It is so gorgeous. It's black and purple. It's a Jeffree Star this year on Thanksgiving celebrated the fifth year anniversary of his brand, of his um, cosmetic company. So it says Jeffree Star Cosmetics. Premium Cosmetics Company, five-year anniversary, Calabasas, California. And it's got these and it's stars in purple. on the it's arm. It's a royal purple and black. And then down the sleeve on both sides, you have the Jeffree Star logo in royal purple. Mm -hmm. And then on the back, let me find it, in royal purple, it says this iconic. Iconic. Near the booty. And this is. Because the booty is iconic. So well made. I want to feel so the soft. It so, feels really well made. It doesn't so feel well cheap. Made. Period. There's Jeffrey like Jeffrey doesn't do cheap on anything. Yeah. He doesn't. Um, I mean, it's like thick, and the sleeves 
down here at the bottom, like, they feel very nice. Yeah, he doesn't go cheap on the aglets and anything are does. nice, and the little rings around the hoodie for your strings are really nice. So, yeah. so Jeffrey always hooks up, and I don't if you got the um, the big Halloween mystery box, you got a full tracksuit in it. My, the tracksuit I got is this green chartreuse color, this. So literally, um, will I ever wear it? No, probably not because I'm a chunky girl and I'd look like, I don't know if you've ever seen one of those You look like a big ass glow stick. <laughs> I would be like a big old chunky glow stick. So I'm not going to wear it, but I'm super <laughs> thankful for it. Um, I said this, sell that shit on eBay. <laughs> but this hoodie actually is a very wearable color. Yes. It's a very wearable um, hoodie. Moving on. Anyways, so the first item I got is a Velour Liquid Lipstick in the color Bronze Blood. Which looks beautiful, by the way. It is a beautiful shade. Yes. Let's watch it for the people. I'm going to. And Go if you get... Go you have to shake them before you use them. If you get a color um, Velour Liquid Lip in any of his mystery boxes that you're like, ooh, I could never put that on my lips. They're safe for your eyes too. So you can use these as an eyeshadow. Oh, my light came off. You can use them as an eyeshadow or an eyeliner. Um, this is gorgeous. They don't have to be strictly for your lips. Just because it's a fuller liquid lip, all of Jeffrey's items are cruelty and vegan free. So you can put them on your eyes. Look at that glow. Look that is that. so pretty. Metallic. Reminds me of my hair a little bit. So, yes, um, all of Jeffrey's products are eye safe, so you can use them on your eyes. The next product I got is a Velour Liquid Lip in the shade Designer Blood. Which is gorgeous. I thought that it was going to look a little bit too brown or something, but it's really pretty. To me, it is like the perfect color of blood. Like blood blood. Like legitimate blood. <laughs> Yeah. yeah. It should have been called like vampire blood or something. But it's like beautiful. Yeah, even those two together. Sick. Yeah, I could pair so those two pretty. together. Mm -hmm. Yes. It's not really metallic. It's picking up metallic on camera because it hasn't dried it's down It's just not yet. dried, yeah. But all of these lip products will dry down matte. They don't transfer. They don't smudge. They don't smear. They don't move. Once they're there, they're there. Like when, It'll take her this, 20 minutes to scrub this Yeah, off once this dries, it's going to take me forever to get it off. The next thing, which I think is probably the most adorable thing ever. I love it. Is this custom reusable straw. And it looks like a candy cane. And it came with a little Let's scrubby. See. It says Jeffree Star Cosmetics on it too, but I don't know what the camera is going to pick it up. There we go, maybe. But it also comes with um, a brush, a brush cleaner. So that is super cute. It looks like a candy cane. It's not a um, bent straw, so it's perfect for any tumbler. Yeah. Oh, I probably should tell you, I paid $100 for this box, but the retail value of the products inside, oh, I just lost the straw, um, are supposed to be over $200 worth, but I only paid $100 for it. The next thing, which has caused so much drama on Twitter, there's been so much controversy over this, is the Peppermint Frost Palette. Um, if you follow Jeffree Star on Twitter, um, he found that people re were reselling these palettes on eBay for hundreds of dollars. So since they were having such a huge resale value, Jeffree simply asked if he should remake these and sell them on his site. People were so vicious. People were saying, you know, this is an exclusive item exclusively for your mystery box. You should never make it again. In my opinion, the people who are mad about him wanting to remake it are the people who resell his items and mark them up. Me, I wanted this palette 
just because I want it, I'm going to use it. I'm not going to resell it. But people were so mean and so rude um, simply because he asked a question. I hope he does remake it um, just for the people who weren't, who wanted it, who weren't able to get this mystery box. Um, I should tell you, it smells exactly like peppermint. I'm not going to taste it because I know it doesn't taste like peppermint. But it probably does. No, it doesn't. Another, <laughs> no, a huge, uh, yeah. So the first shade here, this peppermint looking shade is Ugly Sweater, Igloo Gold, and Chocolate Ice. And they are so gorgeous. I'll swatch them for you. So that this is going to be Ugly Sweater. Oh, and they feel like butter. Holy moly. Did you feel them? Look at that. That was one little swatch. Can you see it? Wow. Yeah, I can see it. So we'll do it on the arm here by my tattoo. Don't put that tattoo on camera. Yeah. We'll lose subscribers. <laughs> I, <laughs> you can't see, see it. <laughs> it. Okay, let's try again. We'll put it on this side of my arm. Ashley doesn't want my hideous tattoo. <laughs> On camera anyway. Let me see. There we go. So that was Ugly Sweater. Sippa. The next one is Igloo Gold. You sniff. That is Igloo Gold. Ooh. I'll put this. There's Igloo Gold. Let's see if I can get so this one is Igloo Gold, and this is Ugly Sweater. Oh, hi. How are ya? Then the next one is Chocolate Ice. That's the one I'm putting on right now. <sighs> oh, that would be a beautiful eyeshadow. So this is Chocolate Ice. Fuck the swatch. Look at my face. Look at that. So, I don't know what the retail value of this is either, but I should tell you, um, the Vanilla <clears throat> Liquid Lipsticks retail for $18 each. We got two of them. The hoodie retails um, for $45. The straw, he doesn't sell one single straw, but I'm thinking they're $5 to $8. Look at my glow with this camera now. Yeah, they shut better on your face than they do in my hand. But... Yeah. Let me just wipe off my fingers because I have a black shirt on and we'll have sparkles everywhere. Yes. Show them the stickers. Um, yeah, the controversy stickers. We got controversial a sheet. stickers. We got a sheet of stickers in every mystery box. This year or this time, I got a small one, a medium one, and a large one. And I got these stickers in every box. They're really cute, but they're stickers. I'm a 30 year old woman. I don't know what I'm going to do with them. But um, if you got the mini mystery box this time, uh, he did refund everybody. So we got that box for free. He refunded them because people were in an uproar that the stickers was considered an item in the box. Whatever. <laughs> the last Whatever. item I got in my box, I'm so, so excited about because I don't own this one and I have almost all of his palettes but we got the thirsty palette and i didn't have this one yet so i'm super excited i think this is um one of his first palettes this one and the androgyny one i don't have androgyny yet either mm -hmm. i love all of those colors you have all of your shimmers in this middle row here, then this row and this row are mattes. You're going to hear the cat. Drink she, some water. She, yeah, she's just getting a drink of water. You probably hear the stupid fucking dog outside. So I'm going to swatch. Ooh, swatch this one. First, I'm going to swatch Snatched. It's this shimmer here. Um, I have shimmer on all my fingers. So 
So that is snatched. I mean, damn. Look at the light catching that. This is like, oh wow. That shimmer is sick. And next, you want to splash? Splash. We're going to swatch splash. It's this kind of teal green. Do you have any fingers? <laughs> Probably turning them a little bit. That payoff is not where I need it to be. Okay. <laughs> Rude kitties. Go on. <laughs> That's a beautiful color. That's super retro to me. So yeah, I didn't have this palette yet. So I'm super, super excited that um, he included this palette. I'm thinking this palette retails for $45. So really just this palette and the hoodie um, paid for the, for the box itself. Yep. Um, if you got the medium mystery box this time, we got the blue blood palette in there. And I don't have it with me to show you. It's at my house. but um, It's gorgeous. It as is. You would it expect. is so, so gorgeous. And that box just came out in 2019. So Or that palette, I'm sorry. Just came out in 2019, so it's a newer palette. And I paid... $60 for that box. The palette retailed for $52. So the blue blood palette came in the medium box and it paid for the medium box. Yep. I need a baby wipe. <laughs> so those are our hauls. Um, actually, wait a minute. Just wanted to talk about a couple more things before we wrap it up. But um, the, the kind of things that we want to do in this video are just things that we really enjoy. Um, I mean, on this channel. And some of those you never know really what to expect from us so not every video is going to be us sitting down showing you stuff um next week we hope to do some gingerbread houses um maybe show you guys some christmas lights we plan on going and looking at um some of the popular places in our area that have the christmas lights up um, such as Chief Logan State Park. There's like a place in St. Albans that has them up every yeah, year. That's really and nice. Ashland. And Ashland's Ashland. really nice. Yeah. We plan on going to like rich neighborhoods and looking at theirs. <laughs> um, yeah. oh, something else that we'd like to do is help advertise for the small businesses. Um, as you see, we spend money and it's mostly with like the big companies but that's not to say that we don't appreciate the little guys out there that are you know with our small businesses making amazing products um, that we just don't know about yet so we would really like your suggestions if you could tag us um, our pages or our group page Scorpio Gems page our YouTube channel whatever if you could filter them to us then we will make a list and we'll start going down them and we'll start finding things that we like and if you guys have specific things that maybe you don't want to purchase but you think that we would be into it and you want us to review them before you buy them um, yeah. let us know <clears throat> we would like to do uh, cooking videos also we want to make sushi <laughs> yeah never done we, it we um, are gonna try to do like um, foodie Fridays where mm -hmm. Excuse me, on Fridays we upload, um, you know, some kind of cooking video. It may just be like finger food or it could be like a full meal. Something simple. It could yeah. be something complicated. Like, we don't know. Um, on Tuesdays we plan on doing, what was it? Talk About It Tuesday. Talk About It Tuesday. Where we just go to um, talk about current events. Just things yeah. that are going on maybe in our state or around the world. Mm -hmm. You know, we're going to try not to get into religion or politics because we just don't do religion or politics to each other because we have totally different views on everything. <laughs> so we're not going to get into that. But, you know, just, um, you know, current events, maybe in the state of West Virginia, maybe, you know, just in the surrounding states or maybe in the world itself. Yeah, like I never heard nobody say, hey, turn on that Nick Cannon. I don't even want to get started on Nick Cannon. <laughs> I have not liked Nick Cannon since forever. Since all that? Yeah. You know what? I wonder if Eminem's diss track is going to have anything uh, about Actually, there is a diss track out. Um, Eminem didn't even do it, though. He had Dennis do it. And if you know who Dennis is, he sounds just like Eminem. Look it up on YouTube. Um, yeah, they did rebuttal. I didn't know that. 
Yeah. I wonder. They just posted it last night. I was at the mall actually um, in Charleston walking around with my phone up to my head like so trying I to could, listen to Yeah. <laughs> without, you know, everybody around me listening to my business. Yeah. But, um, they just posted it last night. You can search it on YouTube. I would leave a link, but there's so many different. Um... <laughs> yeah. Come on. Come on. Um, there's so many different uh, channels and whatnot that have it, but yeah, he did. There's there is a rebuttal. Okay. Well, I'm interested to hear it though because I just love shit like that. Like, who the fuck is Nick Cannon to come in Eminem? Like, for real. Yeah, in um, Nick's diss, he said that Eminem would never be a legend. Bitch, Eminem's already Eminem a legend. Eminem was a legend before you got off that fucking all that stage. Probably before Nick Cannon was even born. <laughs> Eminem's like Eminem's, 47. Yeah. So probably, yeah, before Nick Cannon Hey, was... Google, how old is Nick Cannon? 39 years old. Hey, Google, how old is Eminem? Eminem is 47 years old. Eminem's 47? I, I thought you 47. said 37. No, 47. Well, listen, I will fight Nick Cannon in the street. That's all I got to say. We got to go. We love you guys. Thank you so much for subscribing. And oh, for yeah, before we go, don't forget to hit the like button on this video. Subscribe. Hit the little bell so you can be notified every single time we upload. We're mm -hmm. going to try to upload twice a week. Yep. As long as nothing goes wrong, we will. And Michelle doesn't sleep all day. See the glow on my shirt. Um, yeah, we're going to try to upload twice a week. Hit the little bell button. Like, subscribe. Share us with your friends. Tell Please. everybody about us. Uh, we're not all about makeup, so don't get discouraged if you think that all no, you're going to see is a bunch of Jeffree Star, because that's no. not the case. I'll show you whatever you want. I'll show you a I don't care. Blooper, but we're not going to cut it out. It'll be okay. Nah, fuck it. Your fat dog just got knocked off the sofa. she did. That's it. <laughs> okay. Thank you for watching. If you're still here, thanks for hanging out with us. Yeah. And we hope to see you again. Bye.